The Nigerian Railway Corporation terminals at Ido in Lagos State, Southwest Nigeria. Passengers returning from their daily activities hurry to purchase train tickets that will take them back home. Luggages are weighed and checked in while this passenger finds time to eat a meal before takeoff time. As the engine driver signals for takeoff, the passengers quickly make their way in. The corporation's operation covers seven districts nationwide, namely Lagos District, Eastern District, Northern District, North Central, Northeastern, Northwestern, and Western Districts, and has amongst its services wagons, freight, and passenger trains. Its services is one of those expected to cushion the effect of the hike in fuel price. And here at the Lagos district, there has been a noticeable increase in the migration of commuters from road transport to the railways. We also have uh, experienced a marginal increase in the level of patronage. Our monument has put in place measures to alleviate this uh, added congestion by introduction of new trains and by enlargement of the number of coaches we have. We've introduced two, four new set of trains to help deal with this congestion and to help take in more people who would want to go by rail. Statistics from authorities here in Lagos reveal that 99 sitting passengers, excluding those standing and overflows, fill each coach on trains carrying between 10 to 12 coaches that run on a 12 time frequency on a 15 stop station route. That's about 14,256 passengers daily. It has to transit a Butemeta, a Butemeta junction, Mushin, in that order, Ushodi and Ikeja and all that. We have to give consideration for those who will entrain at such locations. So when it's about 50% filled up to capacity, we, stop the, we try to stop the sale of tickets in order to accommodate those who would have been waiting at this other location that will also want to take the train. The economy class coaches are filled, making it almost impossible for our camera to roll. So we tried a first class coach. This is a first class session on the Nigerian Railway Corporation train and as you can see a lot of people are standing. This tells you how much Nigerians will embrace the system if improved upon. I then tried to find out why both the classes are all sought after. Because it's affordable. Second is uh, faster. There's no doubt about it. It's cheaper. Because if you want to compare your journey on the road, it's more than my journey to my place on on road is 320 and this one is 150. It saved me the stress of driving, it also saved me the stress of going through traffic and also it's easier for me and faster and I live along the track so why why not make use of it? After the days of and bus you need to go home freely. The passengers also made me take their complaints as if I were the customer service executive. The train is not enough for us. All the passengers, all the people that are going, we're still going far. So we still want government to do much for us. They don't give, they give us information. Like yesterday now, I was at Joko. The train was supposed to be there by 9.30. The train was there at 11, uh, past 11 without information. They should put more efforts because you can see people standing. And 500 naira. So they should put more effort. When I did train at the Kedja station, I could only come to terms with the fact that the rail sector requires government's unwavering attention to ease the problems of the entire transportation sector. Henry Ogunjimi, Channels Television News.